So we have two cards here and the Blackmagic Design Ursa Mini. Here we have the Transcend CFast 256 gig, and then we have the new uh, Delkin 256 gig CFast. Um, so a lot of you guys have probably seen this one because you're looking for media and you're trying to save money. This guy's $250 cheaper than Transcend. Transcend probably runs around $550. This guy runs about $300. So it's huge cost savings. But Transcend is certified by Blackmagic Design. This one is not. And this one has some issues. I'm not going to get into technical details about what Transcend can do, but they are certified and they work uh, pretty much throughout all frame rates and, you know, all uh, raw and different compression formats. And so this one worked really well. This guy, you probably want to stick to super low frame rates, your 24 FPS, um, lower resolutions, 1080. It could probably support 4K if you're doing really low, um, you know, comp you know, like below ProRes HQ and uh, low frame rates, but not like 60p. If you're doing 1080, 60, it seems to be okay. Now, I'm going to show you something else that's kind of weird about this card. So, um... First, we'll start with the Transcend. I'm going to put this guy in. And I've done this many times, formatting, and I always get the same result. So let's start with the uh, Transcend here. And let's format this guy. And you'll see how fast it formats. Maybe we can bring up a stopwatch. So we'll bring in a stopwatch here. Let's go ahead and format this card. And, oops. Let's reset this format and go. Let's see how long the transcend takes. Boom, like five seconds, right? No problem there. Now let's take this card out and we'll do the Delkin. Uh, this is what's weird because I've done it several times, shot with it, formatted, and uh, it's just super weird. I'll show you what I mean. So let's uh, go ahead and reset our stopwatch here. Let's format this card to HFS. Format and play. And we'll see how long it takes, because it takes a long time. Yep, 1 minute and 20 seconds to format. That's pretty much what I get all the time. So, if you guys are super on a budget, you might want to look at this for a lot of 1080 and low frame rate shooting. And it'll probably work, but you can't beat Transcend right now. Uh, these guys are the most affordable, best performing card for the uh, Blackmagic Design Ursa that I'm using. And uh, I probably wouldn't get more of these. You can't beat this guy. So definitely, if you guys are looking for the... Uh, Media for the Blackmagic Design Ursa. Uh, get the uh, Transcend C Fast certified by uh, Blackmagic Design to work, and uh, no issues with me.